So I have this big file here. Let's see. It's called phone large. It contains huge list of phone numbers. So let's see how much this up to this point is 8 million, 58 million, 258 million, 2 billion, 12 billion. This is 12 GB of data. I mean, that's a whole lot. Okay. Can't even imagine, you know, if, if I if I display this, it'll it it it'll take I mean hours together for it to get even over. Okay. And if you want to search for a phone number here in this huge database, it's going to be very difficult. Alright. In fact, let me try opening this on my desktop. Uh, you know, it, it's not going to be easy. I'll show you. Um, so you see. I, I will I will try to open this file. Trying to open this file. It is here, phone large, 12 GB. You see, as I double click this, you see, it's stuck. It doesn't move. Okay, it cannot open basically. In no editor can you open this. Okay, let me close this, close this, and then get back. Okay. So, you know, it, it scrolls up and it never gets over. I just cut it short by control C, uh, meaning, I mean, I broke it, broke the process. And now, uh, how do I go through this particular file for an element? Okay. So what I can do is I can indeed, let me see where I am. Okay. So I, what I can do is screen, F equals open. What was that? Phone large dot txt. That's the name of the, okay. I read from it. So the best part is no matter how big the file is, I repeat, no matter how big the file is, you can always read from it. The moment you say read line, it takes you to the next line, next line, next line, next line and so on. Okay. For I in range, let's say uh, 10,000 lines, if you want to read, read line. Let me append this to some S and uh, you know print us see this is always possible and you can keep doing it the next 10,000 the next 10,000 the next 10,000 all right so what do I mean by this by this little illustration by this I mean irrespective of how big the file is take a big file it may not open but you can go line by line okay you can you can basically go line by line by line by line of the file okay i hope it's clear to you right it might take a long time for it to finish but it will never get hung why is that that's because your your file system okay so let me illustrate that your file system is like a big tape like this it's a big tape okay it will start seeing what is in the beginning of this second third fourth fifth and so on like this and so on it can always go linearly in this fashion in your file okay one after the other so although the file is 12 gb it will take its own time but it will it will execute i mean it will go through it one by one that's the advantage of a big file that's how your movie files work okay um its movies are generally uh, you know it's it's a list of pictures okay uh, there'll be millions and millions of billions of pictures and when it displays the pictures in a sequence it appears like a movie and that is taken from your hard disk and processed one file at a time that's also another program you see your movie players are simply yet another program written in some programming language all right so it's important for you to understand that file handling is possible irrespective of how big the file is just that it will take a long time to process it okay so now let me go ahead and show you a nice illustration of this concept from cryptography which we discussed already called the Caesar cipher. Caesar cipher. That will be our next program.